is Mike Callahan, Dr. Filefinder, and welcome back to our special Buttercash.com 10-part series on Routers 201 Intermediate Studies. In this segment, we're going to look at setting up email alerts from within the router. If you wondered, we've set up blocks using keywords and domain names. We've created a schedule when blocking is in effect. But how are you going to be notified when somebody's tried to access a block site? when somebody's triggered the block. Well, you tell your router to email you. So in your router software, somewhere you'll see email. Click on that. Now first you need to turn email notification on. You will also need to know your outgoing mail server. Tell it which email address you want it to be sent to. If your mail server requires authentication, you need to check this box and put that information in. Now you can tell the alert to be sent immediately. So if you want to know right when a person tries to access a site that you've blocked or a site that has the keywords you've specified, you can check that box. You can send logs according to a specific schedule. For example, when the log is full, hourly, daily, weekly, you say weekly, you can say what day, you can also say what time, and you can see here they've compensated for the military time that's normally used in the router. So you can say 9 a.m. weekly on Wednesdays. You can set your time zone here, automatically adjust for daylight savings time, and then say apply. So now we have it set up so that the router will automatically send an email weekly on Wednesday at 9 a.m., or if you want, you can have it send an email immediately when somebody tries to visit a block site. Keep in mind this is a multiple part series and be sure to watch all the parts. Hey, this is Doc. If you're looking for a cheap and easy way to put your own content on the web, go get domain names from Hover.com. Just visit Hover.com slash Butterscotch and you'll get 10% off and support shows like these. Thanks.